Hi, I'm Lee Greenwood. We're here at the Country Music Hall of Fame where my exhibit now exists and it will until May 2014. A lot of the items you see behind me are things that I've saved over the years. Some of the jackets I've worn, of course, the wings jacket made here in Nashville almost 30 years ago and I can still wear some of those. This beautiful eagle given to me by a Cincinnati entrepreneur, Jeff Ruby. Some of these things represent uh, the military, such as this flight suit that actually I got a chance to war wear when I was flying in one of America's fastest jets, the F-16. This Liberty Bell actually came from the militarized zone in Korea, and it was given to me by the people at Warrior Base, the army that backs up the DMZ. This guitar given to me by a soldier who I signed it for, and his dad gave it to him. It was sold at auction, took it around the world, I was serving with the Army. He came back to Murfreesboro, Tennessee, got a hold of me and says, I want to give this gift back to you. These belt buckles, many of them, of course, represent rodeos that I've sang at and played at. Some of them I even rode horseback on. And it gave me a chance, actually, to have some of the belts on display, some of the belt buckles on display. I never really envisioned saving them, but after I got about 30 or 40 of them, I said, I think I'll just keep them as a collection. That was pretty cool. Pictures with some of my favorites in the politics, of course. George Bush Sr., 41, and of course Ronald Reagan, who I performed for and worked for as well. These are uh, country music awards here. I'm very proud of these, of course, in 1983 and 84, touring with Alabama, and then uh, Song of the Year for my song, God Bless USA, which I wrote in 1983. And after 29 years, it was actually released on MCA Records. Here's a picture of my very first band. I'm kind of cool with that. It's called the Apollos. Apollo was a Greek god, and that's why we named it, because we thought we were Greek gods. <laughs> uh, that band, a four-piece group, out of Sacramento, California, and of course saxophone is my main instrument. You'll see one of them displayed here. It is an alto saxophone given to me by the Oak Ridge Boys when I played for them as the opening act at the MGM in Las Vegas, Nevada. So just a few of the items, some of the jackets we had made and some of the things that I've gotten. Very proud of this one's on the end though. Most of all, this is my family. As my mother, of course, and I when I was about 10 years old. There's my family now with my 14 and 18 year old, my beautiful wife Kim on the very end who serves as my guiding light. So there you have it. That's most of the exhibit. There's a lot of things back behind this wall that they'll rotate in and out through the next year. And uh, you're welcome to come down and see it at the Country Music Hall of Fame in Nashville, Tennessee.